Hi everyone, welcome to JavaScript Coding Challenge. In today's video, you have to find the below code output and you have four options to choose from. The question is, uh, there is a variable greeting which is initialized with the value understanding this keyword. There is an object obj with a property greeting and a method get greeting where it will be actually returning this dot greeting and it's also uh, getting uh, an argument greeting okay and in, in within the method we are actually updating the where greeting to hello india and we have a console.log statement where it is uh, calling the get greeting method of the obj object and we are passing welcome to javascript and the four options uh, in the uh, console.log that would be printed are uh, hello world uh, hello india welcome to javascript understanding this keyword so please try from your end and see what is the output you are getting. So let's see how we can actually get into the solution of this particular code output. Okay. So before uh, getting deep into this particular uh, answer or solution of this particular uh, code, right? We have to understand what is the, this keyword all about. So you, uh, so you can see here, this keyword is basically an object. Okay. This is basically an object and the value of this depends on the context where it is being invoked okay so two things this is uh, basically an object and the value of this depends on the context with where it is being invoked okay so by what this i mean is so if i just go ahead and print so for now i will be uh, commenting this out and just i will be printing console.log of type of this okay so if I print console.log type of this, then you can see here, okay, uh, it is an object, okay, so type of this is an object and you can see here, um, okay, and the value of this depends on the context of from where it is being called, okay, so if I go ahead and print this, okay, then you can see that it would be a window object okay it's a window object so because it's present in the global this if i hover my mouse over this this you can see it is a global this and it points to the window object okay that this when it is being called over here it is actually pointing to window object so does this point to the window object the method within the method whether this points to the window object so that we have to find out okay so now we will actually uh, uh, delete this and uncomment this particular thing okay so now we will be actually going through this particular problem so we can see here there is a global where greeting variable where it is having value understanding this keyword and we have an object where it is also having a greeting uh, property hello world and we have a get greeting method okay in that we are actually passing an argument uh, greeting and we are having another where greeting equal to hello india so basic principle of this keyword is that whenever it is a method invocation if it is a method invocation this will be attached to the object from where it is being called you got my point we are trying to actually call this method right we are calling this method from the ob obj object so obj object dot get greeting okay so in this case what happens is it is a method invocation so that this will be actually attached to the obj object okay so now if i go ahead and print this over here console.log of this within that object earlier it was a window object when we are actually printed over here so for now i will just comment this out and when we are now trying to print this within the obj object get greeting method so now if you see here you can see here okay so i will just call this method so now if i go ahead and call this method you can see here this is actually point to the object so this is the object itself okay get greeting method and get greeting hello world okay so uh, the basic thing about uh, this is that whenever it is a method invocation then uh, that this will be being attached to the object that is being invoking okay that's being invoked okay so now you got an idea about this for in case of method invocation okay this is a method invocation and that this will be actually attached to the obj object and this dot greeting 
okay this dot greeting so this if you over over here it is actually pointing to the obj greeting and hence hello world will be printed as the answer okay so now we can actually delete this and just go ahead and print this you will be able to see that hello world is getting printed so if i go to sources and put a debugging over here and refresh this so you can see here the global object global object is already having a greeting so that we have actually created understanding this keyword okay that is still there that is not overwritten when we are actually using this dot greeting that value is still there in the global scope okay if within the object we have another greeting property where it is having value hello world and this will be actually pointing to this particular property available in the object because it is a method invocation and in method invocation that this will be actually attached to the obj and this var greeting hello india it will not be having any significance over here because this actually will be pointing to this greeting okay so now what will happen if it is an uh, this is a normal function so now what will happen if it is an arrow function okay so within this if it is an arrow function so now what will happen to the this okay earlier it was a normal function and uh, we are able to get the answer hello world okay so now what will happen if it is an arrow function then the answer that you might see is uh, it might be a different one okay so for now we will actually go to that so basic principle for arrow function is uh, arrow function uh, it will not be having a uh, this uh, it is not having it will be actually taking from the parent uh, function wherever it is being called okay and in this case this is actually global this so this will actually point into the parent uh, there is no parent function over here and hence it will be pointing to the global object the uh, it is uh, pointing to the global object and here you can see it will be actually printing so if i over the mouse over here it is actually this is the window object so in the window object what we have in the greeting we have welcome to uh, understanding this keyword okay we have this understanding this keyword and hence that would be printed in case of arrow function okay so you can see here so there is no binding of this in arrow functions and hence when we are actually trying to invoke that so this will be actually pointing to the uh, global object in case of this particular example okay so i hope you got an idea about the difference between a, a, a fun normal function and if it is an arrow function okay in the earlier case it was a method invocation and that is why we were able to uh, print uh, hello world but for arrow function it is an arrow function and in the arrow function there is no binding of this so it will be actually taking from the parent function wherever it is uh, being uh, present so in this case the parent function is the global object and hence it is actually pointing to the global uh, greeting uh, variable and it is understanding this keyword okay so i hope you got an idea about this particular uh, problem so i hope uh, that's it for today's video thanks a lot for watching